Hello guys, welcome to my channel Nate Cash on Webtech Zone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn how to open PhD file in your Outlook. Okay, so you can open your existing PhD file, or you can also import or sorry export PhD file from your Outlook data. So I will show you how we can do this. So let's start with the video. Before you start, I request you to like this video, hit the like button, subscribe my channel, and don't forget comments below. So let's start with the video. So guys, I am on Outlook. So if you have already your PhD file in your device or computer, so how you can open it? There is simple way. Go to the file, go to the open and export, and here you can see the op option called open your Outlook data file which is which is PhD file just click on it now find out the PhD file where you have saved so I just uh, find out I just want to open this file in my outlook so if I open this so you can see at your uh, left side one uh, folder or you can see the <coughs> data file will be created with the same name and if you have uh, uh, data in this file like you have calendar data or any contact data so go to the select the file here go to the uh, this uh, dot option and go to the folders then all folders in this file will be expand here and you can check your data okay so you can see I have inbox and all so this is blank data file if you have containing this file you will see here okay now I'll show you how can you import your uh, you know export your PhD file from uh, your Outlook so go to the open and export go to the import export and go to the export to file okay just click on next now click on PhD file and select which file or mailbox you want to export so as you can see I have calendar I have two mailbox here and this is a another PhD file we just upload it or open it so now I, I want to export this one include subfolder also and just click on next this PhD file will be created here you can browse or select another destination so in this you know my device path I will sh uh, this uh, you know backup will be save so just click on save you can choose the option there is a three option you can choose just finish then this PST file will be backup or download on this section you have to just go to the folder and open it and if you want to come back and open PST file again so same face you have to follow same step you have to follow which I show you so guys I hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching